and I know, and you know, and we know, we all know, the ghost lets us smell, it smells so well, my nose. Hi guys, I'm back with another Yankee Candle review, and this time it's in the scent, Cotton Candy. And I am a huge fan of cotton candy scents. Absolutely love them. So when Yankee came out with this, I had to try it. Heard a lot of bad things about it. It's definitely one of those candles that has a bad rep in the community. Mainly just for it being such a light thrower. Um... So glad that I took a chance and went with my instincts and wanted to try it anyways. Now, I mean, to be honest though, I mainly still ordered it just because, again, I love the scent of cotton candy, so I was like, well, I'm probably going to enjoy the scent. Even if it's a light throw, I'll probably still enjoy it because I like cotton candy that much. But, to be honest with you, this candle is throwing pretty good actually, so especially for a very, for a, co a light cotton candy scent that is basically just sugary and vanilla-y, it actually is throwing very well. Um, the other thing, normally I don't do candle reviews till they're lower, so I get more of the experience of the, the candle burn to do a review on, but this one I had to do it when it's up towards the top, well, it's been, it started way up here, so it, it's been, you know, burning now for a while, but, um, I don't know if you guys can see totally the wicks. I'm going to have to probably move the... These wicks do not want to settle down. I have trimmed them, I don't know how many times, I think two or three and times. The flames were huge on this candle, both of them were. And then as it was going down, it was getting worse and worse, so I was like, okay, I guess I'm going to have to do something. So I blew it out. Uh, didn't let it totally dry all the way, but just kind of let it settle down a little bit. And then trimmed the wicks and... Sure enough, probably about two hours later, it started doing the same thing, and now here we are. I think I've trimmed it two times now, and you can see how big these flames are. So, uh, now it's into something weird, but I actually like that. I do not mind trimming the wicks. If it's going to be, I mean, this candle is very strongly fueled. These wicks are definitely, they do not want to settle down, guys. They are some strong, powerful wicks. I don't not know if they're different wicks the Yankee Candle's using, or if it's just that they like cotton candy, or what the deal is. Look at that picture, isn't that gorgeous? But, so in all, all serious, these wicks do not want to settle down. I mean, you can see how deep that wax pool is. That wax pool is easily an inch, if not more. It's very, very deep. So it, it's definitely hot. I mean, I, I can barely even put my hands here without getting burnt, actually. So in return for that powerful flames and that high heat, it's in, it's what's helping the throw, I think. So I am actually getting a decent throw. I lit this candle the other day, and everyone loved it. I had um, a couple tarts going in the scent, and I mixed them with Better Homes and Gardens Fresh Pulled Taffy. And I had this candle going with them, and it, it just created this magical, ethereal type of a scent. It was amazing. Loved it. What can I say? Con candy is gets me every time. So I'll read the scent description from Yankee, but it's nothing too detailed. It's basically just a... Okay, so it says, The scent of this boardwalk favorite is perfectly captured in all its pure, sticky, sweet delight. Oh, that's all they say about it, so it's one of those things where it's just cotton candy and use your imagination. <laughs> but, I mean, obviously for cotton candy, you get the sugar, the vanilla, and maybe slightly... I, I smelled in other, like, manufacturers and vendors, like, they had, like, a strawberry kind of a note sometimes. I'm not sure if I totally smell strawberry with this one. I think it's more just, like, a sugar and vanilla kind of a thing is what I'm smelling. But it does create that cotton candy... <clears throat> Uh, scent, definitely. Got the lid right next to it. It's like a brushed lid. has a Yankee candle on it. Price originally is $27.99, but I got this at the uh, uh, the glitch sale on Mother's Day, so I think this is my one, two. This is my third burn. Very extremely clean burn. I mean, you can see how hot and clean of a burn that is. That's It's a very, very high output wicks, whatever... Whatever wicks they have in this candle are awesome. They're definitely doing their job. Okay, reminds me, or this is comparable to... I mean, really any cotton candy scent, to be honest. It just 
has that sweet, sugary vanilla cotton candy scent. Thoreau on this, I would say out of 10, is probably a 6 or 7. It's up there. Um, especially, you know, sugar is a hard note to get really strong anyways. So, you know, me giving it a 6 and a 7 is being pretty generous, I think, especially with the bad rep that this candle has anyways. So I blame my good throw for this candle on these wicks. And this, my, my personal scent description for this is, yes, just pure sugary, sticky sweet cotton candy. That's what it smells like. Very, very nice scent. And when I repurchased this, absolutely, I love the scent, and I love this candle. This is really performing flawlessly, and these wicks are just, they're entertaining, actually, to be honest with you. So yeah, very, very good candle, amazing scent. I'm going to have to keep an eye on it and probably even trim the wicks again here in a little bit, it looks like. So yeah, very, very, very powerful flames on this one. I mean, it looks beautiful, though, doesn't it? Okay, so that was my review on Yankee Candles Cotton Candy, two-wick large tumbler. Absolutely love this candle. Crazy about the scent. And I'm so glad that I took a chance and got this, because I, I read a whole bunch of negative reviews on this candle. So, I don't know what made me do it. Probably just, you know, my childlike instincts. I just automatically love anything cotton candy, so it was hard for me to resist the scent anyway. So, that's probably what did it. And not only that, but now these wicks are also entertaining me. I love a good, strong, powerful wick that you know, creates just all the more heat, you know, then you get all the more throw. Super happy. Could not say anything nicer about this candle. Do recommend it. I just hope that, you know, everyone else can experience it the way I have, because like I said, I will be honest, I've read a lot of bad reviews about this candle for some reason. So it just goes to show that everyone's different and every nose is different and everyone has a different experience. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching. Smell well.